When is this due? It is due pretty soon. Oh. And I love you guys. Uh, but, um, I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, was it finally gave it to you? Uh, it was this week. Oh, I thought you were going to say, like, the beginning of the semester. It's like, I was like, that's like me. I think you should use your own. Uh, what is my own planner? Your uh, academic planner. My own academic planner. <laughs> do you actually use it? I use something similar. What do you use? Um, I'll show you next time since we only have t about two or three more minutes. Okay. But if you remind me, I'll show you what I use. Um, so um, at the top of class, you guys looked at um, the purpose and main idea that Train wrote. The purpose of the article is how to tame a tantrum of the children. The author shows some stages of a tantrum and how to melt down the tantrum. Um, revisiting, what uh, what standards did you guys focus on as you made suggestions for Clarity, this? Clarity, accuracy, and precision. Not precision, I feel like that's, that's a... Oh, yeah. So you focused mostly on um, clarity and accuracy. You did yeah. some rewording. What was the accuracy issue? Um, it, it wasn't much information to back it up. Yeah. So you had to make sure that... So you needed to add more information, and that goes with which of the, yeah, you have to make it more precise in order to make it more accurate as well. So those kind of went hand in hand. Okay. So and, okay. <laughs> so then you guys um, went down to the key information, and we added relevance in. And why did we do that? To connect it back to me. Yeah, good. It has to support the main idea. <laughs> yeah. that. Um, Train, can you say, um, can you summarize um, what the changes were in the key information? And um, uh, they replaced all the stages. Okay, explain more about the stages. Uh, and uh, then how to work the way around the, how to Okay, so um, do you agree, Philip Casey? Is that um, your your take as well? Mm -hmm. yeah. Since we were, you know, we all came together, make sure that makes sense and everything was accurate. Make sure what did you think um, between relevance, precision, accuracy, and clarity? What were you most um, working on when you did those changes? Relevance. Make sure the the relevant. We was working on all of them, but the main thing, make sure the two things we made sure was it was a clear and it was a relevant. Like so precision, you were trying to add more detail. Did you, um, was there anything um, that you improved on in relevance? Are there any sentences that were not relevant that you made more relevant? Uh, basically, well, we don't have like, what she had before. Right, but she just listed the stages before. She just listed okay. the stages. She didn't give it no support. Well, how did giving support. more support make it more relevant? Um, it kind of explains why they're important to talk about. Like, Why the, what is the, like the detail, what is the detail, how does it help make it more relevant? It makes it more clear in what you're talking about. So the detail adds clarity, okay, so you made it, um, by making it more precise, you think you made it more clear? Mm -hmm. um, and then, were you guys working on relevance after all, do you think, or? I mean, I thought, as we went with the flow, well, I think it was. was relevant them. before, we just put more detail to it. Okay, and then as you added more detail, um, it became more relevant. Okay, how so? Can you say why? <laughs> <laughs> well, what is relevance again? What does it have to be relevant to? Is it important? Main idea. Platform? Main idea. So it connects up back to the main idea. And it does, because we gave those five, the list of the five. Well, we yeah. provided two of them. So um, your main idea says, um, well, you changed it, right? You yeah. added the um, The author shows or gives five stages of what a tantrum is and how to call it. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so that was your clarified main idea. Yeah. And then as you added more details around the um, key information or the important information. Yeah, which is um, explaining all the stages and then in. Can you show me one sentence that um, is now more relevant to the five stages? Um, the stages include anger and sadness, which is when your toddler is a angry. <laughs> angry or sad, though they did. Okay, good. So looking at just that sentence, the stages include anger and sadness, which is when your toddler is angry or 
sad and throws a fit. So um, instead of just saying um, the five stages, you've described it, right? Mm -hmm. You've added, like you guys said, more precision. Um, with that precision, does that make it more relevant? Yeah, yeah I, I agree. Can you say why? <laughs> it, connects. it connects. Okay, what words does it connect to? Stages. Stages. And we make sure we include the words stages or stage. Yeah, so um, some stages, you guys changed to five stages. Yeah. And um, could we say that this is one of those five stages? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's two separate stages, but no one. Two stages. Okay, so you. Well, yeah. Given, um, you've you've given more precision. You've given more detail. You've named those stages, and um, therefore you're making it more relevant to um, the, this main idea statement. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, time to go. Oh, my brain hurts. Thank you. You know.